Hi, in this video we'll walk through how to set up the username and email for Git. The reason you need this is that if you don't have a username and email set, Git won't let you make a commit. And committing changes is how you're able to capture track changes that you make to your work. To get started, first open up a command line window. I'm using Windows 11 unfortunately, so using Git Bash which comes bundled with the Git installer. I would highly, highly recommend using Git Bash as it's Linux based and what's used in the industry. If you haven't installed Git yet, you can watch my video on how to do that. Link in the card up top or in the description below. Now once you have that open, you can add the information by typing in the following. To set the name, type in git config hyphen hyphen global user dot name and then open a quotation mark and then the name you want to use and close the quotation mark. For the email, you can type in git config hyphen hyphen global user dot email quotation mark and the email address you want to use and close quotation mark. To check what you've just entered, you can type in git config user dot name for the name and git config user dot email for the email you set as well. If you'd like to update or correct the information you entered, you can simply use the same commands and set the new information in the quotations. If you want to delete everything and start from scratch, you can use the following command as well. git config hyphen hyphen global hyphen hyphen remove hyphen section user. So there you have it. Now you're all set to start making commits on your potential new project. This will form part of a series I'm hoping to make to show you how to get started with Git and a simple workflow which you can use with all your projects. You can find the list of all the videos in the description to see related ones. And if you found this useful, please hit that like button, share the video, and subscribe to my channel to see more as they're released. Thank you and goodbye for now.